Are you serious? Hey, what's up everybody? This is Mika Naps. I am back online finally. Um, sorry I've been gone so long. I've been going through a lot of changes recently. So, I decided to do a video tonight just to kind of get everybody reacquainted. Um, well, the reason that I've been going through changes is because I had to um, switch out of a job. So, um, it really was something I wanted to do for a long time because I got really sick of people and the unnecessary bullshit they put people through. And yeah, I'm that, I'm not really gonna go too far into it because of the fact that um, I may have to kick someone's ass. I don't know, like I <laughs> I don't want to do that, but <laughs> if it costs for me to do that, I will because and this person, if they ever see this video, I don't care. Um, you put me through a whole lot of unnecessary changes and for you to be, you know, so grown, as you say, what you did was really petty and just mega trifling and, you know, people like you get what they deserve. So in the long run. So with that said, I'm just going to end it there. I don't want to linger on that whole negative vibe. So I'm just going to leave it at that. Um, Moving on, uh, I don't know if you can tell really because of the lighting, but I took my uh, locks out because I was really getting frustrated with how long it was taking for my hair to lock. It, parts of it were, you know, was locking um, like little parts in the back and in the middle. They were locked already, um, but in the front and a couple on the, like the nape of my neck were not locking and they would not lock. No matter how much gel or how much you know product I put in my hair, it would not stay. And also, I was getting a rash like right around my hairline. So I'm assuming that has something to do with my eczema acting up again. I've never had a outbreak since I've been like what 12, 13. I haven't had an outbreak in quite some time. So I don't know. I see you. I'll bring her up in a second. But anyway, I haven't had an outbreak. Um, of eczema for several years and I you know I'm assuming it has something to do with me not washing my hair for an extended period of time and like I said I have to get rid of that the uh, dead skin cells so I had to part with them I'm really kind of frustrated because I don't know what else to do with my hair right now I mean I want to go back to the short style but then again I don't want to have to deal with the the weirdest with you know my hair growing out after that point so I'm just gonna leave it alone and let it does you know do what it does um, I might just get the front of it braided for now just to kind of give it a rest and then um, two strand twist the back I don't know I have to figure it out um, let's see what else is going on um, that's pretty much it I'm not really doing too much extra stuff since I've taken on this new job my um, hours are kind of strange so I work mainly nights I'm off the weekends, so I have a little free time to myself and you know get to hang out with people but being that I work so you know such a weird hour hours I won't be able to like have like little outings and stuff like I usually do like I'm gonna miss like all of my you know my poetry shows so if that ever happens, I'm probably going to have to like make up hours at work or come in later or just use paid time off. I don't know. But that's pretty much it with that whole thing. But I'm just going to skip all the chit chat and get to why I posted this video. It seems like every time I'm out or just, you know, just in public, period. There's always somebody who, you know, just wants to, like, do something stupid to piss me off. I, I, I know it's not intentional. I know they don't know me. I know they don't, you know, know anything about me. But it just seems like some people just do shit to piss people off. Like, that's their main intention. So, for example, today, I'm coming out of the elevator in my building. And I have, like, you know, all my trash that needs to go out for the day. So I'm going out, you know, the back entryway for the um, building, and this chick walks up, and she's, like, in my way. So I'm like, oh, excuse me. And she's like, mm-hmm, excuse you. 
I mean, are you for real? Really? That right there wanted me to, one, slap the shit out of her. Two, slap the shit out of her. And three and four, slap the shit out of her. I don't understand why people are just so rude. I said excuse me, so clearly I'm trying to pardon myself from your space, whatever you were doing. So, I let that shit slide. I really let it slide. Um, and then secondly... I get out to my car and this is within a five ten minute range so people were just pissing me off left to right as soon as I left out of my apartment um so I get to my car and there's this old guy sitting in the car waiting for whomever whatever and he's blocking my exit like I can't I wouldn't be able to get out unless he moved so he goes oh is it your car I'm walking to it I have my keys out clearly I'm going to my car Oh, I'm just checking because I got to move it. Why were you sitting there in the first place? I mean, if you're parked somewhere where there's no space, like there's no designated space for a car, why would you park in a space that's not designated? And also, you're parked right in front of my car. So if I were to attempt to back out, I would hit your car. And that would cause for a raise in my insurance and possibly you suing me so that was a setup clearly that was a setup so I let that slide I didn't cuss him out I was heading to work and this guy did not have the right of way as of yet I was turning into a gas station so <clears throat> I go to turn the arrow was green that means I can go you cannot yet car in front of me goes straight through no problem I get to go and this fool just decides to speed up all the, you know all of a sudden and he's like what, what are, you know I honked at him he's like what what are you doing <laughs> so I just looked at him like you stupid like why 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 is it that people are just so just I don't know I just can't really explain it I can't put it into words just like why is it something in the water I mean is it in the food I'm pretty sure it's in the food I'm pretty sure you know I don't know they're like dumbing people down on a daily basis I mean but I mean common sense people just use it is there for a reason use it this is this is the type of day that makes me want to drink I haven't had alcohol for over like a month and a half um, but days like this make me want to drink I'm so serious about that I don't I don't get it I just don't know why people are just so fucking stupid not to say that I'm the brightest you know crayon in the box but I'm just saying like common sense like we were born with it use it it's there for the taking go ahead and grab that put it in your pocket run with it um ignorance on a daily basis how do you get around that how do you manage to cope with that so yeah if you want to <clears throat> leave comments or post a video feel free to do so